Do you feel like you don't speak enough Filipino? That you need to know more words? Then stick around. With these lessons, you'll pick up some of the most common words in just a few minutes. Now, this video is a small portion of our learning program. To get the full lessons, translations, and fluency fast study tools, click the link in the description and sign up for your free lifetime account. You are at a bus terminal where you're attempting to buy a ticket from a ticket counter. There are four different counters. Which counter should you line up at to go to the south side of the city? Which counter should you line up at to go to the south side of the city? The third counter is the counter for bus tickets that go to the south side of the city. Para sa timog na bahagi ng siyudad. You are at a bus terminal where you've just bought a long-distance ticket. Which row and seat number are you in? Which row and seat number are you in? The ticket says that you're in the eighth row in seat C. Ikawalo na hilera upuan C. You are at a bus terminal where you're reading the schedule for long distance buses. On which days are there no buses running? On which days are there no buses running? There are no buses running on public holidays and the third Sunday of every month. Pampublikong holiday ikatlong linggo ng bawat buwan. You are at a bus stop where you're waiting for the 301 bus. There is a notice posted on the bus timetable. What does the notice say? What does the notice say? The notice reads, the 301 bus does not stop here. Ang 301 bus ay hindi tumitigil dito. You just got off a bus at a bus terminal and you're looking to catch a taxi. Which direction should you go to get to the taxi rank?
Which direction should you go to get to the taxi rank? You should head east to get to the taxi rank. Silangan. You just got a text message from your hotel's pickup service. What does the first number refer to? What does the first number refer to? The number in the text message refers to the customer number. Numero ng customer. You're checking out the hotel's facilities when you see a notice on a door. What does the notice mean? What does the notice mean? The notice reads, do not enter. Bawal pumasok. You search online for the nearest bus service. What bus service does the page show? What bus service does the page show? The web page shows a free bus service. Libreng servicio ng bus. You're about to enter a small shop, but there's a handwritten note on the door. What does the message on the note mean? What does the message on the note mean? The note reads, I'll be right back. Babalik ako. There's a national holiday coming up, and you notice that shops have special notices about having different opening hours. From when will the opening hours return to normal? From when will the opening hours return to normal?
The notice says that the opening hours will be back to normal on January 7th. Ikapito ng Enero. Want to speak real Filipino from your first lesson? Sign up for your free lifetime account at filipinopod101.com. You are sitting on a bus that is about to arrive at the next bus stop. Suddenly, a signal lights up. What does the signal mean? What does the signal mean? The signal reads, please stay seated until the bus stops. Manatiling nakaupo hanggang sa huminto ang bus. You've lost your wallet while riding on a bus. Hoping to get your wallet back, you go to look at a city map to try and locate the lost and found office of the bus company. Where is the lost and found office located? Where is the lost and found office located? The lost and found office is located on the south side of the city, number 12 on the map. Ikalabing dalawa sa mapa. You are at a bus terminal where you stumble across a notice at one of the stops. What does the notice say? What does the notice say? The notice reads, this bus route is no longer in service. Ang ruta ng bus na ito ay itinigil na ang operasyon. You are at a bus terminal where you stumble across a notice at one of the stops. What does the notice say? What does the notice say? The notice reads, this bus route will not run on New Year's Day. Ang ruta ng bus na ito ay walang biyahe sa bagong taon. You've just gotten off a bus at a bus terminal. Suddenly, a person hands you a leaflet. What kind of deal is offered on this leaflet?
What kind of deal is offered on this leaflet? The offer is three for the price of two. Tatlo sa halagang dalawa. You're about to have lunch in a local restaurant. What's included with the main course? What's included with the main course? The sign says, one drink and a dessert are included. May kasamang inumin at panghimagas. You are about to order your lunch and you're interested in the lunch menu. What does the lunch menu say? What does the lunch menu say? The lunch menu says that the best seller is spicy chicken with grilled vegetables. Pinakamabenta, maanghang na manok, inihaw na gulay. There's a notice at the bottom of the lunch menu. What does the notice say? What does the notice say? The notice says there is an extra charge for alcoholic beverages. Dagdag na bayad. Inuming nakalalasing. You're finished with your meal and you're looking at the dessert menu. What kinds of drinks can you choose with the cake combo? What kinds of drinks can you choose with the cake combo? The menu shows that you can choose from coffee or tea. Kape, cha'a. You just had lunch, paid and received your receipt. What is marked with a circle?
What is marked with a circle? The circled parts of the receipt tell you the subtotal and the total. Subtotal, total. Want to speak real Filipino from your first lesson? Sign up for your free lifetime account at filipinopod101.com. You just gotten off a plane and are walking through the bus terminal of the airport. There's a stall where you can exchange money at the bus terminal. You attempt to do so, but the staff member first hands you a form to fill out instead. What information do you need to fill out to complete the form? What information do you need to fill out to complete the form? The form states that you need to fill out your name, the date, the currency, the amount, and signature. Pangalan, Petsa, Salapi, Halaga, pirma. You are at a bus terminal where you've been waiting for your bus. It appears to be running late. Suddenly, you notice a note posted next to the bus stop. What does the notice say? What does the notice say? The note reads, bus services on this route have been canceled for today due to poor weather conditions. We apologize for the inconvenience. Ang operasyon ng bus sa rutang ito ay itinigil na ngayong araw dahil sa masamang panahon. Kami ay humihingi ng paumanhin sa inyo. You are at a bus terminal where you're trying to buy a bus ticket from a ticket counter. A special notice is posted at the counter. What does the notice say? What does the notice say? The notice says that the ticket counter is closed until 2 p.m. and that you should go to the counter in row B instead. Ang ticket counter ay sarado hanggang 2 p.m. Pumunta sa counter sa Hilera B. You've just arrived at your destination, and you're attempting to exit the bus terminal. Unfortunately, the road you usually take is under construction. A signboard is posted informing you of another route. How should you proceed?
how should you proceed? The sign tells you to go in the opposite direction, take the stairs to the underground, and to use the underpass to cross. Pumunta sa kabilang direksyon, gamitin ang hagdan para sa underground at gamitin ang underpass para makatawid. You are at a bus terminal, reading a leaflet someone gave to you. The leaflet is advertising a new shopping center that just opened. How do you get to the new shopping center? How do you get to the new shopping center? The leaflet says that you can use the 301 bus or 303 bus if it's a Sunday to get to the new shopping center. Sumakay sa 301 bus o 303 bus kapag linggo. You're reading an event guide and are going to see an upcoming art event. What does the guide say about bringing food to the event? What does the guide say about bringing food to the event? The description reads that if you bring your own food or drinks, they will be confiscated. Kung magdadala ka ng sariling pagkain o inumin, Ito ay kukumpiskahin. You're planning to buy an instant meal. How much water do you add and what do you do once it's added? How much water do you add and what do you do once it's added? You add 100 cc's of boiling water, wait 3 to 5 minutes, then stir the contents. Magdagdag ng isang daang cc na kumukulong tubig. Maghintay ng tatlo hanggang limang minuto at pagkatapos ay haluin ang nilalaman. You're at the clothing store and want to try on a few shirts. How many items are allowed in the fitting room?
How many items are allowed in the fitting room? The notice says that a maximum of three items per customer are permitted inside the fitting room. Bawat mamimili ay pinapayagang magsukat ng hanggang tatlong item sa loob ng sukatan ng damit. After paying for your shirt, you notice the return policy is printed on the receipt. What items are excluded from the return policy? What items are excluded from the return policy? The sentence means, please note that all sale items are excluded from this policy and are non-returnable. Mangyaring tandaan na ang lahat ng nabiling mga item ay hindi kasali sa patakarang ito at hindi maaaring ibalik. With your receipt, you also received a coupon. Where do you have to present the coupon? Where do you have to present the coupon? It says, present this coupon at the counter at the time of purchase to receive a 20% discount off all items. Ipakita ang kupon na ito sa bayaran sa oras ng pagbabayad upang makatanggap ng 20% na diskwento sa lahat ng item. Want to speak real Filipino from your first lesson? Sign up for your free lifetime account at filipinopod101.com. You are at a bus terminal where you're heading to a special hotel to check in for the first time. According to an email you received, what are the things that you need to provide to the staff at this special hotel? What are the things that you need to provide to the staff at this special hotel? The email says that you need to provide your confirmation number and your passport details. Numero ng kumpirmasyon, mga detalye ng pasaporte. You are at a bus terminal where you are waiting for your bus. There's a notice posted at the bus stop about a new bus route that will be introduced next year. What is the main advantage of this new bus route?
What is the main advantage of this new bus route? The introduction of the new bus eases congestion for each bus on the 301 route. Ang panibagong bus ay makakapagpaluwag ng traffic para sa bawat bus sa 301 na ruta ng bus. You are at a bus terminal where you're heading to the police office to retrieve a lost passport. According to a postcard you received from the police office, what are the things that you need to provide to the police? What are the things that you need to provide to the police? The postcard says that you need to present proof of identification and to pay a small fee. Prueba ng pagkakakilanlan. Maliit na halaga. You are exiting a bus terminal when a big notice posted on the bus stop catches your attention. The notice highlights permanent changes made to the bus schedule. How will buses on Fridays be affected? How will buses on Fridays be affected? Buses on Fridays will now start at 6 a.m. and will end at 1 a.m. Magsisimula ng 6 o'clock a.m. at matatapos ng 1 o'clock a.m. Suddenly, you get bad abdominal pain and decide to buy some medicine. What are the instructions regarding the recommended dosage on the label? What are the instructions regarding the recommended dosage on the label?
The label says that daily dosage, two pills per day after eating. Araw-araw na dosage. Dalawang tableta bawat araw pagkatapos kumain. Your condition is not getting better, and you decide to go to the nearby clinic. You receive a medical report. What is the diagnosis? You receive a medical report. What is the diagnosis? The diagnosis is Food poisoning caused by contaminated food. Pagkalason sanhi ng kontaminadong pagkain. You just bought a few items from a local shop online. What information does the website say about the delivery date? What information does the website say about the delivery date? The website says that Delivery dates differ depending on the delivery method, but all dates should be calculated from the next working day. Ang petsa ng pagpapadala ay depende sa paraan ng pagpapadala. Ngunit ang lahat ng petsa ay dapat kalkulahin mula sa susunod na araw ng trabaho. The day after ordering an item online, you receive an email notification. How can you track your package? How can you track your package?
The email says that you can track your package on this website by logging into your account. And after logging in, click on your order history and enter the order number found in this email. Maaari mong subaybayan ang iyong mga padala sa website na ito sa pamamagitan ng pag-login sa iyong account. Pagkatapos ng pag-login, mag-click sa iyong kasaysayan ng order at ipasok ang numero ng order na natagpuan sa email na ito. You're reading the instructions of an electronic device you've just bought. What should you do in case of overheating? What should you do in case of overheating? The manual says that if you notice the surface overheating, Unplug the device immediately and allow it to cool down before handling again. Kung napansin mo na ang ibabaw ay sobrang init, bunutin sa saksakan agad at hayaang lumamig muna bago uli gamitin. Remember, here's what you can do to learn all of these words by heart. Drill these words with our spaced repetition flashcards, which will help cement these words into your long-term memory. Save them to the Word Bank, your personal vocabulary collection where you can print out your own study sheets, or review the words with our looped vocabulary slideshow and play it until you know all of the words. So click the link in the description right now and sign up for your free lifetime account to get these lessons and study tools.